So what we're doing here is allowing members to go into um, situations that they may not have been in before um, and experience those, those kind of situations in a safe and um, somewhat enjoyable learning environment. The latest project we've got at the moment, which is Travel in the State, is the Computer Simulation and Virtual Reality Roadshow. Now the Roadshow um, will be visiting each district and displaying some of the latest technology that we're either delivering or we're looking at to, to um, deliver in some form um, in, the, in the future. Uh, so the main system we have there is a flame system uh, developed by research from Deakin University. Uh, they've developed a system which simulates a breathing apparatus. Uh, the breathing apparatus consists of a virtual reality headset which provides the visuals um, in a 3D and augmented, so augmented reality, so you see what you're seeing, uh, we place fire over the top of it. It also includes a mask, so you can simulate your breathing as well, um, and the BA set itself on your back, which is designed to uh, simulate or replicate the weight of a breathing apparatus kit itself. So technology like this allows us to simulate um, environments or situations that we can't easily or can't at all simulate in a real, real world environment. Um, unless we go and burn a house down, um, it can be somewhat um, hard to, or difficult to, uh, to replicate those kind of environments. So technology allows us to simulate those and place you in those environments. Uh, so when we get to a live environment, you're, you're a little bit more prepared than what you would have been otherwise. The flame system itself uh, can be used for structural fires with the breathing apparatus, can be used for non structures with the breathing apparatus. However, it can be used without the breathing apparatus itself. So still have the headset on, but we'll just have a longer cable so you actually don't have that weight on your back. So if we're looking at something like a grass fire, not necessarily going to wear a BA there, um, you can actually not have the BA on and simulate a similar environment. So you still have the hose, you'll still have the headset, um, you just won't have the BA in your back so you won't have that extra weight that you, you wouldn't have in a real life situation. So it's designed to replicate actual uh, 38 or even a 64 um, coming off a pump. So you open up the branch, you'll get that force feedback that's designed in the flame system as well. So based on your settings, so you can have uh, different flow rates, 110 up to 570 on these particular branches we're using, and you'll get that force feedback. Uh, you can also change it so you've got a straight jet or a fog, and that'll appear in your in your headset as well. So you'll see those different um, that different. Uh, haptics based on that. The roadshow um, will be visiting each district and displaying some of the latest technology that we're either delivering or we're looking at to, to um, deliver in some form um, in, the, in the future.